Well, it's time for us to interact with the Wadulos, interact with Bahani, interact with Jackie's, the music collective, and uh, get to know them better and also experience them on a personal level and also on a musical level. So that we get, uh, by, the time, by the time this show is done, it's going to be a very a different feeling altogether. I'm in the Friday mood and I was telling my colleague right here that are you sure you want the weekend to end without us even grabbing a cup of tea? <laughs> I'm hoping that you are inspired as well to get into the weekend and have it going very well for you. So I'm going to be interacting uh, with, uh, with Mark for starters and uh, I would like to know more about him. But for those that watch UBC, you know him already. I mean, he has graced your screens before in a different element. That's what I've been, that's what I've been saying, in a different element. So... I'm going to let him introduce himself again, fully, and uh, then from there, we can know uh, what next are we going to be discussing. So, Mark, good morning once again. Good morning, Shata. How are you? I'm very well. How are you doing? I'm very good, uh, and I'm honored to be here this time in a different light. Uh -huh, different yeah. element. A different element. Once again, tell us about Mark. Well... My name is Wadulo Mark Arnold. I don't have any other alias. I'm not called any other name. Mm -hmm. So I'm just <laughs> organically who I am. Okay. I'm a creative artist, a musician, music producer, and by passion. Okay. And then by profession, I am a news anchor here on the National Broadcaster, Uganda Broadcasting Corporation. And uh, I must say, this is not news to most of my colleagues here. They've already seen that aspect of music and they've always wanted to, you know, were, I'm sure they've been curious to see it bust out. <laughs> I know, I already see it in their faces and they're like, okay, you're an anchor, but how are you again seeing it again? <laughs> right. But yeah, it's something that I'm always honored and privileged to showcase whenever I'm given the platform. Um, tell us briefly about, uh, about the Music Collective. So this music collective is a collective of five people so far. Right now, Wadulo, Mark Arnold, and Sharon, Rebecca, Wadulo, make the Wadulos. Then we have Jay Keys, who is a sound engineer, and I'm sure he'll be able to talk about himself a little more later. Then we have Bahani, who is also an instrumentalist, and uh, we are working with full-time with full musicians here, graduates that are that have studied music from its core. Right. Yeah, unlike me and Sharon, who mm. are more of doing it as a passion, right. we're performers right. with a passion. Right. Jakey's and Bahani are graduates in mu at music school, so we are also privileged to work with them. Right. Yeah, so Walter Asiku is another member of this collective, and, and the, the collective, collective is growing. It's, it's not, not just the five of us. Mm. We're, we're a collective uh, trying to put together, together a band, band. Mm. yeah you, you know, know how big a frigo band is yes you know, there's so, so many talents in there but you, you know they, they come together and unite and put that fusion out mm. Mm. so mm. that's a similar way we are trying to conceptualize our collective okay. uh i can say we're still at the early stages of it mm -hmm. and but i know the future is great great yeah thank you okay thank you so much uh mark now um I'm not alone in studio. I have my colleagues Sonko and Olive, and I'm so sure they have burning questions. So, Olive, yeah. do you have any burning questions? Of course, I have <laughs> burning questions, and it's uh, mine go to Sharon, Rebecca, or Adulo. Now, if uh, there is something I love to see, I love to see husband and wife working together. Right. And of course, these ones sing together. And uh, th there was a moment where he was telling her things in the song and she was blushing. <laughs> it was nice to watch. But I would like to ask you, Sharon, what does it feel like working with your husband? Is it easy? Is it challenging? How do you find it? I am blessed, thank you very much, first of all, but I am blessed by God to work with my husband. It's a blessing. Yes, it's a bit challenging, but I look at the brighter side of everything. Okay. And God has been faithful and good to us all the way. Ah, I like that. And of course, you also told me, like, offset, that uh, you're into business. Yes. So how do you balance business? You know, earlier we were talking about balancing career and maybe profession and then uh, talent. How do you balance your business obligations with uh, your singing? 
the fact that we have a studio at home, Gold Star Studios, uh, it's very easy for us to do music at any time. Any free time I get, I just do music. Ah, that's nice. Packs of working with your husband. Packs of working with your husband. <laughs> he won't complain. You, you brought dinner late. <laughs> no, he won't. He knows you went to He studio. sees what you're doing. <laughs> wow, I love that. Yeah. Um, Sonko, would you be having any questions or any burning questions uh, for the Wadulos or Jackies mm. or Bahani? Yeah, uh, sure I do. I, I do have for, for the two gentlemen. One is uh, Jackies, who's on the piano. Um, Jackies is a songwriter a music graduate as well, and a producer uh, for all of you who are actually watching and have been able to at least feel the music that he was actually bringing out. Uh, well, of course, we would want to know if Jackie is, is um, quite different from the rest. Jackie, uh, as a graduate, what makes you different from uh, the ordinary sound engineers that we have? Uh, good morning, everyone. Yeah, those who are watching. What makes me, what makes me what? Uh, different from the other sound engineers we have, since you are also a graduate uh, in the same profession. Uh, what makes me different is that, like, I've taken another step, not, not, to not only focus on the talent that I'm able to create something or bring something out from me, but take another step, like, to get more knowledge to those who are experienced, like, from my lecturer who is more experienced than me, gives me knowledge and be able to, when I put that knowledge together with my talent, I'm able to bring out something different, create something of my own, create a sound that everyone would love to listen to, a sound that would change a person's life. Yes. And uh, of course, um, when you mentioned about changing a person's life, just briefly, uh, do you, what do you read in regards to the music that we have in the country from live music and, uh, you know, the music that is produced, I should say? Which do you think you're good at? Um, I'm good at a lot of stuff. Let me see. Musically, I'm good at a lot of stuff. Me, myself, I'm good at singing. I'm good at writing. And I'm good at creating music that can last for a lifetime. Okay, uh, I think my next question will be going to Bahani. Uh, He's also known as Zano. Zano. Um, so, Bahani, you're also a music graduate. Uh, by the look of things, uh, how have you changed the, the entire narrative of music and um, what inspired you to do uh, what you're doing? Okay. And I decided to go and study music and what I've done, I've put up a studio there at Zana. It's called Audio Giant. It's my studio. So I'm doing there big, big things that are doing uh, something great to the music industry. Yes. We've um, I've been a very huge fan, by the way, uh, most especially for your guitar. <laughs> Sounded good. <laughs> Thank you. Mm. Um, for, for music lovers, uh, you would get yourself paying attention to uh, to, the, to the music itself, the lyrics, and also the instruments yes. that are being used. And uh, we can't deny that, yes, he did a wonderful job as well. He was serenading us into the weekend, <laughs> making us fall in love. And of course, the Wadulos themselves were, eh, that song that had Malaika, sweet what? I enjoyed it. I loved it. And I also love that they gave us a bit of everything. They gave us some uh, good music in English, and then in Luganda, and then in Lusoga, so you have a bit of everything. everything right? Good job, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you so much, the Wadulos. Thank you, Bahani. Thank you, Jakey's, for being with us. And uh, to you, our dearest viewer, thank you for watching Good Morning Uganda Friday special. And uh, we look forward to seeing you on Monday. Our work is done. Together we weekend. We are leaving you with the collective, and uh, they'll be ushering you into the weekend for now. From me and the rest of the team, have a very wonderful day and a very wonderful weekend.